There's a particular building that stands in the concrete jungle of downtown Honolulu. It precedes the many buildings that now tower over her. Despite being one of the oldest buildings downtown, over 2,500 people continue to pass through her doors each week. They are the Catholic faithful gathering to attend liturgical mass. On July 9, 1840, missionaries from the Congregation of the Sacred Hearts of Jesus and Mary broke ground for a new church, a Catholic church to be built in the Hawaiian Islands. Three years later, on August 15, 1843, the feast day of the Assumption of the Blessed Virgin Mary into Heaven, the cathedral was formally dedicated. The title, Our Lady of Peace, was given to the first Roman Catholic Church in Hawaii. The cathedral had humble beginnings with a simple wooden structure, an altar, communion rail and pulpit, and floors covered in lauhala leaf mats. The cathedral building and its interior experienced several decades of renovations. On May 21, 1864, a certain Joseph de Wuster from Belgium was ordained to the priesthood in the cathedral. 145 years later, Father Damien de Wuster of Molokai would be proclaimed Saint Damien by Pope Benedict XVI. The bells of the cathedral rang out on November the 8th, 1883, announcing the arrival of the SS Mariposa as it entered Honolulu Harbor. The ship carried Mother Marianne Cope and six Franciscan sisters sent to assist Father Damien on Molokai. In 2012, Marianne Cope herself would be elevated to sainthood. The Cathedral of Our Lady of Peace houses the relics of both Hawaii saints. Because of its historical significance and having the distinction of being the oldest cathedral in continuous use in the United States, the Cathedral of Our Lady of Peace was placed on the National Register of Historic Places in 1972. An interesting historical fact is the location of the very first Kiabi tree in Hawaii, which is on the cathedral grounds. This tree is the parent of all the Kiabi trees now abundant in the islands. Likewise, the Cathedral of Our Lady of Peace serves as the Mother Church of the Catholic faithful throughout the Hawaiian Islands. Students receive a high-quality Catholic education at the Cathedral Catholic Academy, the parish school of the Cathedral of Our Lady of Peace. The upkeep and architectural needs of a building that is well over a century and a half old can be a daunting task. This is being addressed with a renewal campaign. Additionally, the vision, plans and designs of the campaign will help evoke a feel of 19th century Honolulu when Saints Damien and Marianne were in the cathedral.
The cathedral is held together by more than coral, wood, iron, and concrete. For nearly 170 years, the true foundation, the mortar, the fabric, the heartbeat of this historic church continues to be her people. Generations of clergy, parishioners, lay ministers, and volunteers have taken part to preserve the cathedral's legacy. A dedicated and committed people, the cathedral's people, share a common bond. They are tied into the history of the cathedral, which spans over a century and a half. Rich in history, culture, and tradition, the Cathedral of Our Lady of Peace, Mother Church of the Catholic Faithful in Hawaii, a servant of her people. <laughs>